Croeso i Goyle with Oniaith Prydain. It means welcome to the British Science Festival. I'm very excited about the British Science Festival this year because it has a fantastic programme. It's 100 events over four days. We're really excited to be bringing science to people. The British Science Festival is an amazing opportunity to find out how the chalk and blackboard things you can learn about at school in the classroom can be translated into amazing inventions and activities. Three, two, one. They're absolutely loving the very compelling way science is being communicated. We do want to reach out, we do want to make clear that science is everywhere. I have OCD and I'd always wanted to write a book. And they started to pray for mercy. <laughs> it was really nice to have people who were like way up there, the top of their field, but be able to understand what they were talking about. I went to a fantastic talk today, Ten of Us Cancer Choir. It made me so emotional. You go into science because it's interesting, it's fun. Apollo 8, 10 seconds to go, you're go all the way. I've never met an astronaut I didn't love. I went to see Dallas Campbell interview George Abbey. That was really interesting, finding out about the past 50 years of uh, human space flights. Tonight I'm going to be speaking mostly about the making of the album The Race of Space, which was our second album which covered the sort of golden age of manned space exploration. So this is the demo I'm just using the standard wire samples. We meet in an hour of change. It's not just hard science, people can go surfing with some surf scientists and produce music through the waves with our sonic kayaks. Robot voices talking about climate change over here. Saw the equipment, never seen anything like it before. It was pretty cool. Everyone loved the music. We were just chilling out, like listening to the music. It was uh, pretty good fun, yeah. <laughs> We have an empathy machine. The electrical brain activity from one person would affect the visual setting of what another person would see in a VR headset. I think people are very intrigued, very interested. I'm a member of Swansea Hack Space. We're a group of people who just like to make stuff. I sew, I do electronics, other people like to 3D print. We're in Plantasia that explores the relationship between art and science with the theme of creatures of the night. I've just had my first ever VR experience and yeah, it was pretty cool. It was quite abstract, really interesting and I felt like it was following me at times, but very relaxing. I've been really, really blown away all the amazing activities. Science is really interesting and it's really important. So why not have a musician? Why not have a comedian? We should use every medium to communicate science. It's really exciting, Festival Science. I really enjoyed it and would really recommend it to anyone. Getting people engaged with and talking about science, I think they've done a really good job here. The British Science Festival is absolutely fantastic. You learn so much. Being here, seeing all the fantastic props, events, debates and workshops, seeing it all come to life. I really cannot thank enough the wonderful staff at Swansea University and our partners in the British Science Association for working with us to bring this about. I'll remember this for many years to come. But this is the first that a man aboard reported to his compatriots here on Earth.